We work to build strong relationships with our partners in state. So that's caucuses and many times candidates. And we work to make sure that they are implementing tactics that are based on best practices. We, I think, present the best of both worlds. We have experts in these fields. Every single one of the RPDs has run a program like this before. And I think that our relationship building combined with our strategic insight gives us the ability to really shape these programs. Having been a deputy caucus director myself, I know how hard the job is. So I would say it's one of the hardest jobs in politics and you have dozens of stakeholders, elected officials, sometimes 20, 30, 40, 50 candidates running for office that you're in charge of. And they all have different interests and um, conflicting interests. So it's nice to have a partner who comes in, understands you and shares one goal, which is either maintaining power or achieving power. Um, and you're able to work with that partner to do what you need to do. Whenever I was actually on a call with the Giving Circle community from Minnesota, Steve, Minnesota, and we were talking about the program in state and they expressed unprompted that like the field operation in Minnesota was totally different than they'd ever seen in the past. And that it was like so much better than it had been in the past. And I think that our early investments in Minnesota and the Senate allowed them to scale up this really amazing effort that they've knocked on now, I think over 475,000 doors. And that hadn't been done in the past. And in Pennsylvania specifically, I think the early investments we made on their deep canvassing program really set the stage for a robust campaign, not just in field, but in terms of their earned and paid media programs. Those programs were really informed by direct feedback from swing voters at the doors that they were able to build relationships with over the off year and get feedback that informed the messaging and helped the program as a whole become more robust. And I will say it also helped us hire and maintain some really strong talent in the field department in Pennsylvania to the point where they have knocked close to a million doors. I'm really proud of the candidates we have endorsed. They're amazing humans. They're on the front lines of protecting democracy. We know how important this cycle is. They're diverse. They look like the communities they're seeking to represent. I think that's really important. They share the same struggles, dreams, values, and it's just exciting to be able to support such a diverse, array of community leaders running for office. The States Project takes a real holistic approach on governing power and making better outcomes for the people that are living in these states. And that means thinking strategically and creatively about where investments might make impactful differences in the state. The amount of rigor that we apply to every dollar that we raise and spend is absolutely the amount of rigor we apply to the, the decision-making process as we spend those dollars. State legislative races are severely underfunded and your support has been invaluable for a lot of people. It's really, really hard to ask friends and family for money, myself included, so I know what it takes to do this work and and I'm really grateful 